Hi, I'm CC, and I'm here back in the villager trading area where last time we did a redstone farm, and it has been successful. <laughs> Look at this, this is absolutely obscene amounts of redstone. I, 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 I it, yeah, it's, it's good. Uh, and it's not even like, that's, that's not even the whole haul. Like, look, there's even more. <laughs> like, this is all the emeralds that I got that overflowed. Like, these guys would, like, their trades were locking faster than I could actually, like, use up all the emeralds. And this is roughly from about 100 boxes of rotten flesh mixed in with a few stacks of gold blocks as well, just to sort of keep the supply and demands in balance. And it has done exceptionally well for me and I am so excited and because of that I can now get on to my next project my next big project being my storage room but before that uh, I made this and it sucks so this is an old design for a like piston elevator the issue like oh it all works great but the issue is that I have bad connection so I just kind of fall through it so like, if I had perfect connection that'd be great that would, that would work every single time but because I'm British on an Australian server, I just get keep, get keep getting pushed out, and it's it's not great. Like, I, I also tried using out a minecart, and uh, that didn't work either. So overall, yeah, there's it's, it's, it's piston elevator, not going to go. So what I want to do instead is just have like a water one or something. I'll probably end up using stairs most of the time anyway, but it's going to be nice to have a way up and down. But anyways, hi. I didn't say hi to women. It, it bugged me. <laughs> Whoa. So what's this redstone going to be used for? Well, it's going to be used in here as this is going to be my wonderful storage room. Now, I'm not really a big fan of storage rooms usually because they take up so much space and they just, it's, it's, there's too many items in the game now to do like proper storage rooms. So instead, I'm going to do a sort of storage depot, which makes use of multi-item sorters, but I'll get into that properly in a bit. So I'm going to start by making the input and then from there we can sort of go over all of the multi-item sorters. But basically I'm going to be using a design by Lummy that has been modified to fit my uses. Hi! Oh, hi! No, oh, hi! There we go, got it. Okay, so this system is going to have two inputs. We're going to have a regular item input, so you put loose regular items in here, and then over here we'll have a shulker box input. So on the back here, I'm going to need to have two little systems that kind of connect to each other. So let's quickly get them together, and then I can give you a quick demonstration of what it do and why what it do. What it do. Okay, it is now the next day because I have been having what's officially known as poo poo doo doo connection. I am currently using a VPN, and hopefully it will hold out the connection for a bit longer. I think my brain is failing me because I'm I'm really struggling to explain this. But basically, this here, this 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 complicated pile of redstone, is a item input. Like this is all this this, this all, all this does is send off a minecart hopper to then get sorted in the system. But the reason that it's so complicated is that basically we have to prepare the minecart to then be sorted. Because essentially, if I quickly just put some items into over here, as we have two item inputs, we have a regular item input and a shulker box input. I'll just put in some mud into here. Once items go into here, that will then set off this pulse extender and it will slowly time out. And once it finally does time out, it will send out a micro hopper. Whoa, look at it go. And that will be down here. Now, the thing is, this micro hopper is going to be a little bit weird as inside it actually has four more micro hoppers and a piece on then in all of the mud. And just get rid of that. And then the same thing will happen again. Yep, there it is. And it's again with four micro hoppers and some mud. Now, the reason that we need to do that is for a later step in the process. But the way that we actually do it. So in this dispenser here, we have a bunch of Minka hoppers. And basically, when one of the Minka hoppers gets dispensed, it will grab out five other Minka hoppers. But one of them will get taken out by this hopper down below and put back into the system, which leaves the Minka hopper down here with four hoppers and an empty slot. And then that empty slot will again just kind of get filled up with whatever items are currently inside of here. And the reason we want to do that, I'll get into what I've made this bit over here. Um, I need soul sand. What? Uh. Uh. Oh. What? Vanishing chest. What? Ow. That 
gonna be really bad. Ooh! Are those amethyst shards, like, critical to the design? Yes. Really? Yes, they are They are 100% necessary. Because they are used with aligning minecarts to be, like, perfectly centered on a block, I think is the under I think that's the, the logic. Ooh, that's cool. Wait, did you come up with this design? Or no, so this is a design by a guy called Lummy Thief that I've modified to work for my specific requirements. Like, the item sorters are the same, but the input I've changed. Hi, BH. This is what is the staircase? Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, I had TNT issues. Hi, are you a criminal? <laughs> um, ignore that. Okay. Wait, there's one... CC, why did you take me all the way around? We've walked like three miles to get here. <laughs> such such critics. Here's my uh here's my box of Philly Willies. What? Uh, okay, so this is a multi-item sorter originally designed by a uh, Lummy Thief that I have modified to fit my specific needs. So this chest here, you just deposit any random items into. And this one over here, you deposit shulker boxes of items, and basically they'll get taken through the system and fully sortified. So if I just quickly put, question. yeah. So the um, the shulker of items does it all have to be the same item? Nope, it could be anything. Is... So oh, behind cool. here, there's an a shulker unloader, which will basically just put them empty the shulker box and then just chuck the shulker box into the sorting system to get sorted itself. So in here. I'm just going to chuck in some like pink petals and some redstone. And then if one of you goes, and then let's put this into here. And then in the other one, if one of you guys want to just chuck in some of the redstone torches and kelp, and then that should put them in, and then just press the button, and that'll to activate the shulker box unloader. There we go. So back here, this will now, this will now start loading up minecart hoppers with items. That then gets sent through over here into a bunch of water stuff, and then sent through blocks into there, and then now oh. the items. Oh, you, you okay down there? Yeah, it's a bit dangerous here. <laughs> and now the redstone items should be going into the right hand chest here, while the plant stuff should be going into this one here. So there's the redstone torches in. Oh, it's like. Wait, so you have categories? Yeah, so it's basically a categorizer that will like. That's so cool! Yeah. What? I hate storage rooms because they are massive for every. There's too many items in the game now. Like there's way too yeah. many items to have individual sorters per. So yeah, there's redstone dust going in now. What? And then over here, they see the pink petals have started going in. The only issue is with design; it's a little bit slow. But that's like I can speed but that it up. That doesn't really matter because you just chuck it in and yeah. then just the thing. You don't really need to, you just need to just hang around the area, really, and it'll just do its thing over time. Oh. oh! Yeah, careful, it's, uh, it's not easy to get around here. But there's a dispenser here with minecart hoppers. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming! I'm coming! <laughs> that was really well framed. Yeah, uh, This is insane. Yeah. It's ridiculous. It took me a while to uh, understand the system, but... <gasps> Uh, inside each of these chests here is basically your categories. So you just you basically just fill each of these chests oh. with exactly what items you want to go into each of the like sections. Wait, that is actually so cool! Oh my god, what? So that's what my filly willies are for. <laughs> They'll basically fill the spot until. How the heck did you guys get over this? Just like you can just go um... inside here. <laughs> oh. Well. So I'm going to have each of these chests set to like a different thing, so I'll have like wood, I'll have Whoa. stones, bricks, redstone. Wait, that's actually really simple. Yeah, it's so simple, isn't it? What? What? No, it's not! <laughs> oh, the concept. I've never been more confused in my life! <laughs> uh, okay, so item go in, item come out. Thank you. No, it makes sense. Hey, okay, now it like... is simple. Yeah. <laughs> The the idea makes sense, but if I was trying to make it, I would be absolutely oh yeah lost. Just 
ridiculously lost. Like, there's so many mechanics here that I just wouldn't think to use. That's it. It's like, it uses, like, I understand the concept, but, like, definitely the mechanics are, like, I would never even attempt to use scaffolding in, like, this. But it's, it's, it's I know. genius. Like, just seeing <laughs> scaffolding like that is just, is weird. Yeah, it doesn't seem right, does it? But it works. It, it only this works for scaffolding. This is insane. Yeah. The amethyst shards, the pots. Yeah, I didn't realize amethyst shards breaks mine. They don't. As well. No, it doesn't. This, the, these, these, uh, these cauldrons here are filled with lava. They're, these are the things that break the. Uh, so the, the, is the amethyst just a uh, to make the sure the hole goes? The amethyst I is to align it. It, 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 it. Sorry, say it. <laughs> was the was one that... thing I knew because Sorry, you so told no. me. Because I told you before you got here. <laughs> God, I love being on Backyard. It feels so <laughs> professional when I log on. It's like, oh, yeah, this is like, this is what I've been working on. And it's this, it's this scramble of redstone stuff. Yeah, you say that, BH, then oh, turn around. <laughs> it's so professional. <laughs> So last night I did a stream where I finished off the redstone for the remaining modules and it looks absolutely wild. And just look at how many hoppers there are. It's absolutely obscene. I'm going to have to see if I can uh, play around with the design somewhat to decrease the amount of hoppers. But it is now all in. It's all functional. And I've also put in the items for a bunch of the filters, including the redstone, the like furniture and just accept like decor blocks got some like terraforming stuff bricks more bricks stones more stones and then over here we have some of the woods with like the oak birch and spruce together the dark oak acacia and jungle the bamboo cherry and mangrove and the nether woods as well as some extra space for some of the modded woods added with some of jay's mods uh, i'll have to go through the rest of the modules and sort them at some point but for now, it is definitely working and it is completely functional. I did a test run where I put in a bunch of items to see if they all get sorted and they mostly did. There was only one issue and it was a bit of a catastrophic issue. But I think what happened is that over here, I have a chest where I put in shulker boxes of items. And then those shulker boxes get unloaded into the chest down here. And then once one is finished emptying, it breaks the shulker box and puts it into the chest down here to get sorted with the rest of the items. The issue is that the shulker boxes don't have anywhere to go. So they kind of just fell off the end over here and just started piling up over here. And I think what happened is that the system just eventually ran out of minecarts. And because it ran out of minecarts, it started taking... It just started to be like minecarts with like empty slots in them so when they went underneath these filters they started taking just random items and then that started to cascade into like a, a, a plethora of issues but it is all working now hopefully and i've got a friend here too this is barney he is my fish i saved him for my redstone and i put him in one of the little aquariums that crispy showed me so cute but anyways uh, the next step is going to be to actually connect up somewhere for miscellaneous or unsortable items to go and the minecarts get set back into the system like the rest of them just so I don't have to worry about like any if I put in the wrong items over here it won't break anything they'll just kind of go over here and just pile up in random chests and I need to actually go about making all of the aesthetics in here because it is a little bit ugly <laughs> but before I do that I want to quickly show you a clip where uh, Hul and Cole visited me and it went a little bit wrong. Just a little bit. Hello, CC. Hi. Um, oh. It is I, the Queen of the North. And Hello. Cole, my general. Hi. We are both quite short. Uh, don't mind that. <laughs> <laughs> it, it happens. In the North, we're not very tall, okay? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, it's cold up there, and you got to condense. And we have yeah, exactly. a, a great matter to discuss with you, CC. I see. See, I see. Have a, uh, a very important letter for your eyes only. There oh. you go. Oh, I see the name of it. <laughs> uh, do I do I just read it now or just like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you can, you can read it now. You've committed. It has come to our attention, we the nation of the far north, Salora, that you have committed grave crimes against us in your attempt to gain the skull of a frog. This frog being the one known as Geraint the Raisin. A beloved and esteemed pet of the Queen of the Far North. 
In committing this crime, our nation will hereby will retrieve this skull, and we request that your lands become the ownership of the far north as one of our vassal states. As a vassal state, you would still keep your power as leader of your people, however you'll be subject to the queen and her laws and taxes. If this humble request is not met, the queen will be angry. Consider this well, and as your warning. Signed, Hulandite, the queen of the far north, the nation of Salora, and then you got some like little twinkles. Yeah, uh, I okay, see. That's my stamp, my official stamp. Yes. So, so yeah. I I see. So this 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 letter implies that you are gonna both kill me and keep me alive. What what's that about? Cool. No, we didn't consider this far. <laughs> Uh, you're the general. You're the. <laughs> He's supposed to know these things. Uh, you're the acting I didn't oh, write the letter, so. I would also I'm sorry. You didn't, you didn't hear like that? to state that the last time that me and Cole fought didn't go amazing for her. Yeah, that's that's why she's the the general. The general, she's not the fighter. Oh, yeah, oh so Chris, be... fighting. okay, so I've got yeah. some time until my head is taken. I see. Yeah, Crispy does yeah. the dirty work. Cole's uh, mm -hmm. just the paperwork person. I see. Well, I'll make sure to prepare some TNT for Crispy. I know he's a big fan of that. You say that I will be subject to your laws and taxes. Would you mind yes, elaborating? Humble. Request. humble. Uh, How well, humble? You know, in the far north, we are in desperate need of very many supplies and all sorts mm. of things. So it would be it, the taxes are reasonable for us, you know. What materials? But we know in the southern lands, perhaps you know the taxes are a bit lower. L lower as in non-existent. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what exactly are you looking for specifically? Uh, Grant's head. That's interesting. I, I don't know how I could... That's not really much of a tax, as much of more of a payment. I don't really have a supply of those. I can get a the supply. The tax is, is after the fact, you know. Oh, okay. So you want the head, and the, the then... The great head is, like, the first thing we request, and then eventually, you know, we'll have taxes for, like, you know, simple things, like huge amounts of gunpowder, things like... <laughs> simple yeah. things, yes. Yes, just, very just... easy to acquire things. It just, you know, your life you... and your... Well, uh, if you want gunpowder, uh, wait, what? Hmm. Nothing. You didn't hear that. Oh, okay. Well, if you want some gunpowder, you can, you can, you can come this way. Uh, what have I done with my supplies? Here they are. So, um, this this gunpowder, what is it going to be yeah. used for? We plan on going to war. Oh, with who? Ah, uh, we haven't decided yet. It's just we want to, you know. I see. I see. Well, if you want power, I have the supply. In here, and also in this one down here. Is this your liking, Cole? Will this supply the armies? Hmm. Oh no. Oh! Uh-oh! Well, I guess we're, we're going to war, Cece? Mutually assured destruction. I just lost a decent chunk of my gunpowder supply, and I will lose more in this war. You understand? Okay, well, uh, yep. Yeah. Expect mm -hmm. our uh, official declarations in the mail. Mm. Oh, I fully expect to. Bye! Bye! See ya! I have to repair this. They come here expecting stuff from me? Me? This letter? Ow! What's that? That's that what's that ruined it. This letter? This letter of claim of my home? Nothing. I stand for nothing but the destruction of Salora. I I guess. Now here's the thing. This 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 oh, oh there's there's a, there's a certain coal. Hello there, coal. If you wish to find stuff, Hello. then that might not exist anymore. But I can supply you with some some gear. Yeah, I have that feeling. <laughs> uh, okay. So you want some you want some new some new clothes? Here's some new clothes. Uh, here's some mending protection for pants, some, some unbreaking boots. Uh, feel free to just rummage through these box of books for anything that tickles your fancy. 
So, so here you go, have some experience. That, that, that you help you get some levels. Sent a message. <laughs> By the way, Cece. Hi. Ah, oh, that was fast. Yeah, the mailman was really quick. Oh, yeah. Have fun. If you need any more Bye, stuff, Cece. feel free to just pop by. Unless it's gunpowder, I've kind of lost some of that for some reason. I'm not sure how. So I guess I'm going to war. Yay! It's a real cascade of events that caused this war, but I'm not one to back down. I shall bring my fiery wrath upon ye or whatever, I don't know. But before that, I want to get my storage system finished. So how about we do a little bit of time lapse dun dun And here we are. Oh, it looks a lot better than it did before. But it's still got some work to do. I'll play around with some of the decorations and stuff. And I want to add a bit more functionality in the future. But I think that's best saved for another time. Especially over here. Because uh, I, I, I've just kind of left it like this. Because I have some more plans for redstoning over underneath here. And connecting out the rail network to the actual storage system. And there's lots to do. So I figured I would save that for another time. But aside from that, the aesthetics are looking quite nice. I went for an interesting palette with mangrove, amethyst, and crimson fences, which I think is quite a cool sort of mix. And I've went for some kind of chaotic looking rafters and pillars and such to really just uh, make it feel a bit more lived in. And it kind of echoes the design I did over in my brick storage, which is quite nice too. So the final step for today is going to be just, well, putting all my stuff in here to get sorted. So I can finally get rid of my chest monster down there. Oh, it's a happy day. And once all the items go through here, I'll see exactly what items I currently have and also which ones still need to be sorted. Oh, sorted. FPS is failing me, so I need to do this quick. So let's end this off with me emptying my chest monster. And I really hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye. Ow.